Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I've been hearing a lot of people saying, Oh my god, the grape is in a poo poo, it's not that good. Guys, today I am here to prove you wrong. I am here to show you that grapes are the absolute best, juiciest fruit within the game of Skyblock, okay? But you, got, you guys want to know what else is juicy? Subscribing to this YouTube channel, because apparently 80% of you guys still aren't. But yeah, guys, <laughs> I was pretty much doing a little bit of thinking, right? And I was thinking to myself, what is the absolute best way we can farm ourselves these berries because quite honestly um they are kind of hard to farm they're not the easiest thing like i'm not gonna lie they are kind of tricky but guys after doing a tiny bit of thinking i think i came up with the absolute best method to afk farm berry it is afk it is overnight all you need is a simple auto clicker that just spams f i mean most people already have these things and it's going to be absolutely awesome and even you don't even need to have an auto clicker you can even just do it yourself so guys pretty much what i realized if you go and reset your character what will happen is you will respawn at the same block facing the portal every single time and guys if you haven't seen the like my last video i uh, tried to reach uh, build limit uh, in in the game and uh, or what do you call it like build length and uh, i made this giant path of grass well what if we covered this entire pathway of grass entirely with grape farm we like grape and we would just you know run off the edge at some point at the end and when we respawn we will just restart the cycle it is an infinite cycle of farming and harvesting like we will spam f as you can see i just spammed f and i don't have any berries in my hand of course i would have those in my hand and what would happen happen guys is i think if i hold right click on a berry bush thing i don't know what you call it it will automatically place them back as you can see i just placed those all back so that is the theory behind it all now we just have to put it in practice so that is going to be like placing absolute metric tons of uh, these things which is which require a lot of birch wood so we're going to have to do a lot of birch farming we're going to be having to do all kinds of crazy stuff but guys i think this might actually become one of my personal best farms okay and of course guys if you wanted to you could do the exact same method with berry bushes if you have a lot of berry bushes it's just not that accessible to the public, you know? And we're here with Melon. Hello, Melon. Where did you go? <laughs> you left. <laughs> uh, I'm on my island. Okay, okay. All right, so guys, I'm just gonna start farming my birch wood up uh, because that's the highest priority uh, thing to do right now. If you ever wondered, by the way, what the best way to actually farm uh, wood is, it's actually building a grid like this of just trees because pretty much what happens if when you farm one tree, a new tree will almost instantly spawn most of the time. As you can see, a new one just spawned. And well, it seems like we are gonna have to do this for a little while because the plant boxes are way overpriced. <laughs> so guys, we're getting about four birch wood per tree, which is actually pretty good. So this is not even that bad of a thing to have to do. Like you just gotta do this for like maybe 20 minutes like maybe an hour or something to get this whole thing set up pretty good but guys i'm just gonna do that off camera i'll be back with you guys as soon as i got that done okay all right guys so i've just harvested 900 birch wood guys i also don't want to overshoot it and guys you might think to yourself jesse that must have taken you absolutely ages and it took me some time it was like 15 10 minutes i think it was like 10 minutes man it wasn't even that bad but uh here let's just start crafting a bunch of these things because uh you know that's really the only thing we can do so i've just now crafted myself a bunch of them. let's see yeah okay so you said that you've also put okay you've put 30 in here as well which already puts our total amount to 70 which is actually insane so we can officially play 70 of these damn things man finally man we're making some progress I, bro what if we what if we got like 10,000 too many Ugh. yeah let's start placing these things guys this might very well actually guys i was doing a little bit of thinking right and you can only really consider your farms to be as efficient as as many totems that you have so i was thinking to myself like our farms honestly really aren't that good like it's like having what like what do three like well, maybe like a hundred things Things. Like, this should be very compar comparably good to already our previous farms, Melon. We're about halfway, I think. Maybe a little bit under halfway. Well, here, let's actually clean up a little bit of the tracks that I've left here <laughs> from, like, a, a different thumbnail. I the seed. I the oh, you're starting planting seeds. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I also have a million gold right now, a million coins, so I should be able to really easily uh, plant and buy a bunch of seeds. Oh my god, Melon, you just bought all the seeds, didn't you? <laughs> well, thank you for saving me my money. <laughs> Dude, this is starting to turn out actually really awesome looking this looks dope all right melon back to harvesting more trees because that is honestly the worst of it all like honestly it's not even that bad you just like literally guys look at this okay look at this okay i'll, sh I'll show you the strategy you stand in the middle boom tree farm pl place a new plant boom keep doing that over 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 and over again until you got more wood let's just keep it going guys get back to getting some more wood and we'll see you all back again when we are ready to actually give this thing a proper test run also guys really quickly though i wanted to mention that i actually think that grapes grow really fast i'm not 100 sure about this uh, we would have to do some some tests to be sure but it feels like they grow really fast is that just me melon mm, no it's true it's true e. so grapes grow fast that's a that's actually a thing then e, e, e. 
Damn. I mean, that that will on, honestly only play in our advantage. That's got, gonna be really nice. All right, guys, we just got another thousand wood, so we should be able to craft ourselves quite a few more of these trellis. Trelli. Oh my God. Come on, craft a bunch of these up. We got another 30. That is not that good. <laughs> we, I, we th I thought we got a lot more in that time, but we did not. All right, Melon, you can actually farm these uh, for this run. I wanna, guys, I wanna do an AFK farming test to see how good this actually is, okay? Because I honestly think this could be really, really good. But how much do we have left? Oh my God, Melon, there's not that much left. Let me be almost there. Oh, yeah. We're like halfway. <laughs> <laughs> We're like halfway, but uh, yeah. <laughs> Here, I'll actually place my grape for, uh, grape seeds as well. Here, there. Boom. Plant it. Well, Melon, we're getting back on the job of farming. Yeah, we're like halfway right now. Let's get back to harvesting more wood. <laughs> All right, guys. Be right back. <laughs> All right, guys. So it's currently about an hour later. Melon had to go. And we got ourselves 3,000 wood to keep buying more of these stupid... Ah! Come on, craft me. Final ones. I don't want to do this anymore. Okay? This is going to be my final craft, guys. We are going to set up the AFK farm that is going to make us rich, okay? We are going to be Persian God. I don't know if that's the thing. All right. We've spent all of the money we have or all of the wood we have. Let's see. We got exactly 100. So, oh my God, this already looks insane. <laughs> I guess we're just gonna keep placing more and pray that we have everything filled in. Like that's the goal. All right, guys, we're getting closer and closer to the end of this stupid, come on. Come on. Build limit is right here, guys. There's nothing to worry about. Absolutely nothing at all. You know what, guys? I'm actually gonna just be okay with this. I'm gonna be okay with it. Okay, I'm gonna just settle with just about not perfect because honestly, I'm gonna go insane if I keep building on this because it's almost five in the morning at this point. All right, guys. So this is gonna be the end of our line right here. And we're pretty much only gonna have to add in the seats. And I think we're gonna be done. I have to, a lot of stuff to buy though. So I really hope this thing at least breaks a profit. That would be nice. You know, like I don't even know if it will at this point. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. Like I've literally been working on this thing for like two hours now. <laughs> All right, let's get some seeds. I have no idea how many of these seeds we're actually gonna have to get. And I actually have no idea how expensive these are. So I hope they're actually not too expensive. Okay, so onion seeds are 2,000. These are 3,000. Well, there goes $300,000, I guess. <laughs> well, that is what you're gonna get. I hope we're gonna make it back. I think we're gonna easily make it back, actually, guys. Like, honestly, I did a little bit of thinking about it and like how much money this farm should actually generate. And it should be like into the million stuff. So it should be all good. Like, I'm not too worried. All right. Got 25 more. That should finally be good. Finally enough. Oh my God. All right. And that is finally the whole farm planted. Oh my God. So guys, what I'm going to do right now actually is I'm actually going to sell every single grape that I have just so that way I can see, like I, I can do one full harvest and see exactly how many grapes I will get from doing every single harvest, so to say. Sell everything. 600 coins. That is not that much, but it's okay. So let's see how much we will be able to get from doing an entirely full harvest. All right, guys, let's see how much we got from that. So it's single harvest gives exactly 300 grapes, which is actually really good, especially considering these grow back as fast as they do. Like, I mean, you can see right here, half of them already all the way, all the way grown back. Or right, let's, let's see how much this sells for. 6,600 coins. Wow. Well, guys, I think that means that there's only one thing left to do, and that is to get a proper little bit of an AFK script set up, or like just an auto clicker, really, is what I'm talking about here. So I'm gonna reset character, and I've given it a little bit of a shot to see if I kind of already knew what I was doing and stuff. So let's see if this works. I don't even know if this will work, to be honest. So here, let me grab my grape seeds, hold them in my hand, and let me start the thing up. So pretty much I'm just holding forward and I'm just spamming left click and F. It's very simple. So let's see. Well, I mean, obviously there's nothing to farm. Of course there's nothing to farm. What was I thinking? I just did a harvest, guys. Well, I'm gonna go AFK for an entire night and I'm actually gonna time myself on like how long I'm gonna be AFK for. So that way we get an exact number on how, I mean, you can see it's placing seeds, I guess. You can get an exact number of how many seeds we get per hour and we get like a really good accurate description. So guys, let's do that. I'll be back with you all in one minute. All right, guys, I just woke up and what I came to is this. I slept for five hours, apparently. A little bit less because I walked the dog. And here I am in build a boat. Or build a boat. What am I saying? I'm so morning tired still. All right, guys. So as you can now see, we are in game. And once again, five, five hours of sleep. Five hours in game. So let's see what the grand total financial uh, push forward is from this farm, guys. Keep in mind, um, there's a little bit of loss here because, uh, you know, you miss a couple placements here and there. And there's a couple things that just kind of go wrong. Uh, let's see. I haven't actually seen this yet. We have gotten ourselves 24. 4,000 grapes. That is really good. That is really good, actually, I think. Here, let's see. What happened? What just happened? Okay, there you go. Okay, so let's see. Is jam... Okay, I can't sell jam in the bakery, so that means that it's the optimal way to sell it. Let's see. Sell crop, grape. Oh! Okay, that's not that good. I think my other farm makes, like, 
a million. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, I have a sad announcement to make, and that is that I think that this might actually not be the best farm in the game. I mean, I might have to expand it then. If I expand it, it can definitely become the best farm in the game. Like, 100%. I don't know if I want to do that. <laughs> I'm just so far deep into this thing. Like, I don't know if I want to do that. Maybe I'll see, guys. Guys, if you want to see a video on maybe a gigantic berry farm, I'll recycle it. I'll make it even bigger. I'll make it even crazier. I will make the biggest berry farm, okay? The biggest AFK berry farm. I will do it. But guys, until then, we're gonna, I'm going to see you guys off right here, okay? 25,000 grapes, what I pick. And honestly, I think that Mike might make me the richest grape person in this game because nobody uses these things. And that's a bloody fact because that took me way too much time to collect. But guys, with that, we're going to end off today's video, guys. I hope you had a fun time with me today, guys. If you want to see me more, make more fun, stupid, crazy farms like this one, please let me know down in the comment section. But guys, with that, we're going to see you on the next one, boys. Peace out, everyone, and bye-bye. <laughs>